So what I'm going to show then is the new feature in Cortex 4 for post-processing data. It is a, an additional menu option in the template ID and template rectify menus inside Cortex 4. So what I have here is the old version of the software, the Cortex 3, in which we have two menu options. And in the new version of the software, we have an additional option at the top of each menu or icon. This particular option indicates that the operation is to be performed over all marker sets at once rather than just one marker set at a time. And this feature by itself is the new processing tool inside Cortex 4 that provides an incredible amount of power and uh, efficiency in, in the processing. By doing the work over all marker sets at once, the process becomes much more efficient. And by way of demonstration, I can show you in the old way of working, and this is Cortex-3, if I were to select all the marker sets, make them uh, named, I'll go through each one, make it unnamed. Normally the way I would work then, if I'm starting from a raw set of data like this, and I'm scrolling that back and forth so you can see that the data is unnamed all the way through, I would start with one of the marker sets. I uh, would do a template ID on that marker set, and then I would do a template rectify. And this operation is something that I would perform for each of the marker sets in my capture. And what you can see then is that the data has only made it part way through. Once it gets reached a certain point, the template breaks down, markers have gotten lost, occluded, and so the template rectify stops because it's run out of enough markers to satisfy the template. And that's been the way it's normally worked for, for quite some time. And then if I were to go to the next person in the list, I would, or the next marker set, do that template ID, template rectify. And again, you can see that the processing gets stuck about halfway through as soon as the interaction between different performers begins. And then it bogs down and has trouble finishing its operation. And it's finished and only again got about halfway through before it uh, it had to fail. By contrast, if we work at all marker sets at once, in Cortex 4, if I go through the same process, I take the original data and I make it unnamed, like so. And if I scrub through, you can see it's all unnamed. And I say template ID with all marker sets that they're all identified. And now I say template rectify over all marker sets. You see how fast that was? That zipped right through all of it. And now if I scrub through the entire process, you can see that all three marker sets are rectified all the way through with no errors. That's the difference between what we had before and what we have now with the holistic template processing in Cortex-4.